all right guys so welcome back to another video uh today we're going to be <laughs> all right guys so welcome back to another video uh today this time we're actually going to be making a phone holder um you know pretty much just browsing through thingiverse and we came across this really cool like car seat for like a race car um, yeah. phone holder so it's pretty cool uh, went ahead and downloaded the file already so we're going to be making that um, obviously in this video as you guys can see by the title of the video so just stick around the video to see the process of us uh, printing this uh, phone holder it's going to be really cool I think we're going to choose some pretty cool colors uh, we're probably going to go with red and black I think that's going to be pretty good you wanted to do blue huh but I think we're going to stick to red and black what I don't know okay so um, again, you guys can find this link down below. So let's go ahead and get started with the uh, seat. I think we're going to do red for the seat. So okay. let's go ahead and get started with that and we'll show you guys how it looks like after it's done. just finished up and uh, this is only the uh, seat obviously this is what's gonna hold the phone I still got to take off all the supports from here but pretty much that's the way it's gonna sit uh, there's still gonna be the roll cage um, in the back you know what we still have left as well as the little rails that go on the side so so far it's looking really good um, the seat actually came out a lot better than I thought it was even gonna look like um, I don't know, what do you think? Do you think it's pretty cool? Pretty cool, huh? Looks like yeah. a, looks like a little race car seat. Um, I like the red, you like the red? Yeah. Looks pretty cool, huh? So yeah, let's go ahead and uh, go to the next step, which is gonna be doing the uh, roll cage. And then um, we'll show you guys the little rails that go on the side and how to assemble the iPhone or I guess just any regular phone holder. Okay, so the roll cage is now done printing. Uh, as you guys can see here, uh, it is all done, um, just finished up. So these are all the supports that we went ahead and added. Uh, I got a few right here that pretty much did not come out well. Um, these were actually printing straight up like that and they kept breaking at about halfway. As you guys can see, there's that missing or that broke off right there and so did that one. This is the top section that broke off right here. So, little pieces that came off right there. Uh, so this is what we have and we're gonna go ahead and take it off and remove all the supports. Uh, this is the way that it actually printed out for me uh, correctly. So, without breaking or anything, it's obviously, you know, on its side, so. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, start taking off all the supports. Alright 
right, guys. So now the uh, rails are now all done. So uh, let's go ahead and look at what we got here. Okay, so here are the rails uh, that are going to pretty much going to hold the uh, the cage and the seat together. Uh, you are going to need, I believe, it's a couple screws. I believe I saw that it's going to be the uh, M3 um, by 10. So that's what you're going to be needing for uh, this phone holder. Let's go ahead and uh, take these apart and then get on with the next. All right, guys. So now that it's pretty much um, all assembled together, um, we're gonna go ahead and look at the, uh, you know, pretty much the final result. This came out really cool. Um, you know, we're into cars, me and my wife. So, uh, you know, seeing this phone holder with the seat, the cage, um, it was just pretty awesome. Uh, you know, something really cool to go ahead and uh, print. So why we did it um, I like the colors that we chose as well red and black um, you know definitely if this was if this is our car or some stuff that we wanted in our in our car I think a, a red seat and some black uh, you know rolling cage would be definitely us so that's why I went ahead and printed this obviously we don't have it but this is really cool um, so yeah let's go ahead and uh, show you guys final result just so you guys know don't have the screws yet um, they're actually on their way um, so just gonna show you guys I uh, could just grab some paper clips and uh, you know pretty much put them in the hole just to hold it together for now but uh, again this is the final result here's the print so here it is Alright guys, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the different prints that we did um, to be able to assemble this uh, together and pretty much, um, you know, what we have is going to be the seat, uh, the rails, and the cage obviously. So uh, let's go ahead and show you and show you pretty much how it's going to be put together. Okay, so here is, obviously we have the red seat. Um, those are going to be the left and the right rail. And then we also have the little cage uh, that's going to go on the back. Um, so all this is going to get connected together that way when you place your phone in here it won't just fall back um, this and the rails kind of you know holds it up together that way you can you know hold the weight of your phone so um, pretty much how it's going to go uh, how this is going to be placed together is if you guys can see it's got a little groove right there um, that's pretty much where this piece is going to go into so you guys are going to match up the holes right there um, the back two holes are going to be connected um, there and right there so pretty much like this okay so this is going to go something like that um, and then same with the other side it's just going to go on the other side alright so um, you are going to need some screws. I'm going to go ahead and list those uh, screws that you'll need right on the screen. Um, pretty sure you can get them from like Home Depot or anything like that. Um, so yeah, you just got to go ahead and uh, put that together. I don't have the screws yet. They're, I actually ordered them from Amazon, so they're going to be on their way tomorrow. But I'll go ahead and uh, start putting this together. Uh, I believe I can do it with some paper clips um, just for now, just to show you guys and to end this video. But like I said, in each one of those holes, uh, you're going to need, I believe it's four screws on one side, four screws on the other side. So, yeah, just go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and show you guys the finished product. All right, so something I wanted to show you guys about the seat um, is pretty much the detail that goes into, um, you know, the creator or, you know, person, whoever made this seat, um, you know, honestly, uh, they did a really good job. I don't know if you guys could see, but it almost even looks like, you know, the pads are right there. You could see the lines um, to what would be in the regular seat. Here it would be like pretty much the padding. Um, but I don't know if you guys could see, it's really hard to tell, but 
um, right there it actually even says Recaro on there which is obviously the seat I thought that was really cool to go you know into that much detail um, other than that I mean this is really cool again I do have to sand this down as well um, just to get that uh, finished looked but other than that um, yeah here it is all right guys so thanks for watching this video um, you know this is something really cool um, just really proud of you know how it came out and uh, yeah see you guys on the next video thanks for watching